<laughs> doesn't matter. It's like it's a human thing. Ghosting someone is just, it hurts. And I'm sorry if I've done it. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I try not to ghost anybody. Sometimes you have to distance yourself from people who are going to do you harm. It's like, mm, when have I? I have definitely ghosted. I have sometimes, I don't have the mindset to reply to some things. And it's not because I don't like someone. That would be Fred. You know, if you ever text him at, after 6 p.m. wanting to hang out, you often won't get an answer or you get an answer and you'll be like, I'm sorry, I'm too tired, I'm going to bed. Who goes to bed at 6 p.m.? I doubt that to be true. If there were actually aliens, we would have seen them by now. Given some of the people that I know, I could really believe they could be aliens in disguise. I believe in aliens. I know they exist, but among us, like on Earth, maybe not. We can't be the only living thing on this little rock in the whole solar system. I'm not crazy. Absolutely, I believe that. You know, with all the UFO things, right? How come we have been sending out all these tele, you know, messages throughout space and we haven't gotten anything back? Yeah, if it's such a bad day, like, oh, my um, dog needs, you know, you know, whatever. I mean, you could. I don't know how, how that person would take it. I'm not really into you. Sorry. I don't think it's acceptable. <laughs> I mean, it has to be really bad. Or you, you threatened or something. Well, like what date? Do you know what I mean? If it's a hundredth? No, actually, I think it's always acceptable to lie. You don't really have responsibility to the person. After a hundred, you should be, you should respect them a little bit. 